So, why am I so lonely? Well, that's one big question. <laughs> so, hey guys, it's Polar. And, um, I don't know why I'm on this YouTube channel. But I'm gonna tell you the story of my life. Well, I look like a dog, but I used to be a cat. It was really weird. It's like I had two lives, but I didn't. I didn't. It was weird. They said that I started out as a dog, but then I changed inside my mom's bell. And then I was born as a cat. And now I'm a dog again, and I don't get that. So this is the story. I don't really know why I am a dog now, but even though I was born from a dad and a, and a mom that was both cats, which is kind of weird. So I'm going to figure that out. So, later, in part two or something, I don't know. I'm going to ask my mom. Anyway. So I hope you guys like my backstory. See ya! Is she alright? Oh, yes. She's perfectly fine. Here she is. Um, you bet your bill is, um, $500. So, yeah, I'll have to pay it in at least a week. Sorry, but... There is a very, um, crazy virus that is in her that might change her whole life. We don't really know what virus it is, but we're trying to make up a name for it. And we don't know how it happened. So, um, is there any things that you did with, did you ever marry or have a boyfriend before you married or met your husband? Mm, not really. I mean, it depends on if uh, you count my ex, my ex, my uh, husband's, uh, my husband's brother, I met him. But that's the only boy I've actually ever talked to, except for my husband. Really, the only boy. The only boy in your family that you've ever talked to. Um, yeah, I guess he's in my family now. Ah, well, what, what type of animal was he? I'm not really sure. I don't remember anything. All I care about is that my baby is nice and sweet and is healthy she is very healthy but the virus is still going on inside her so don't worry if anything strange happens to her okay yes ma'am okay i'll be in the out in the hallway talking to the other doctors if you need me just call me okay on that phone right next to your bed okay thanks see ya boy well aren't you a little cutie you are so adorable I can't wait to change. I can't wait to brush out your fool and give you all milk. Oh my gosh, you're so cute. Oh, I wish your father was here. He's out in the war. Just that. I really wish your father was here. That means he could see your beautiful face again. And you know what that means? Love. Oh, you're so cute. That means that you will always remember your father in a way. Isn't that cute? Isn't that cool? Cool. Oh. Yeah. I guess you are pretty tired. I can tell. Here, let me fix you. There you go. Go to sleep, sweetie. See you in the morning. Okay? Good night. Three years later. I didn't need to. Uh, um, I made breakfast. You did? Yep, cereal bowls. Oh, yeah. You always 
do that every morning. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I'll be down in a little bit. You go ahead and eat your cereal. I need to think about something. Okay, see ya! Eat my bowl of cereal. Eat my bowl of cereal. No. I know French toast. And cinnamon toast. Oh, yeah. It's basically cinnamon toast crunch, but I call them cinnamon toasts. Cinnamon. I just add, put toast bites in there, and then I put cinnamon, and I'll bake booey goat. I wonder what mom's up to. She said she'll be down in a bit. Like, it's been a bit. It's like, it's been like 30 seconds. Where is she? Mom? Mommy! Mommy, where are you? Are you in the attic? Just kidding. Are you in the freezer? Ooh, those are some fancy shoes you got there, ma'am. Oh, yeah, she has a fancy doll. Yeah, she... <laughs> okay. Hmm. She must be talking on the phone or something. I don't need to worry. I'm just going to go to my room and play dolls and do stuff. Not... Yeah, stuff. I'm going to do stuff. Okay, maybe I can do parkour up there. My mom never lets me do it. But I'm gonna do it. Jump on this chair. I dump on the chair. And then I go on here. And then, okay, there's a ledge. Yeah! Okay, I did it! Okay! Ah! Mommy! Mommy, help me! Okay, okay. I take the table! Oh, crap. My mom didn't hear that. Good. Good. I didn't get hurt or anything, but it's still not good to fall and kind of injure your paw. I'm gonna walk up the stairs. Since it's the safest way. Okay. Oh, crap. I keep on falling. Why do I keep on falling? This house is a mess. Especially my room. I'm spoiled. I'm a spoiled kitty. Yay. Okay. Oh, I'm going to sleep in my bag. I'm kind of tired. Even though I'm like three years old. But I still meant to take my naps. My little baggy. Good night. Come on. Pick up. Pick up. Pick up. Please, honey. Please pick up. Hello? Hello? Oh, honey, are you okay? Are you okay? Are you okay, honey? Is everything alright? Um, did you lose any limbs or anything? I'm perfectly fine. Don't worry about me. I, um, I injured my ear a couple, and there's like a little hole in there, but, um, good news! I'm gonna be coming home in, uh, two months. So, I can't wait to see our little girl. I love the pictures you send me in the mail. They're so cute and adorable. I just can't wait to see her. I mean, it has been a really long time since I saw you, too. It's actually been three years, but... No, that's okay. Actually, four years. It's been four years. I left right whenever you got pregnant. So, I'm kind of sad that I didn't... wasn't there to take care of you or drive you or anything but my brother took care of you right yes many various times i mean he um he kind of went crazy once he uh went into my room he looked through all my stuff and he kind of looked through all my drawers making sure there wasn't anything that would hurt me it was just kind of weird anyway oh well, I understand if he does that. He's just being him. He likes making sure that people he cares about um, is safe. And I also got this pink scarf for a little girl. And I heard she had a virus. Yes, she does have a virus. They don't know what it's called. They still haven't figured it out over, this, over the three years. I'm kind of scared. And I don't want to tell her... She has a virus, because she doesn't know that she has a virus. And I've been noticing that her tail's growing darker, like, every day. I mean, I'm scared that she's going to be... Is it the color kind of like me? No, it's like dark blue, you know what I mean? It's really dark, and I'm kind of scared. It's forming on her paw, not her tail. I'm going out of my mind. But, um kind of nervous. I don't want her to be having a 
disease or a meltdown right now. So, <laughs> it's kind of bad if that happens. Uh, um, uh, yeah. Whew, I'm so scared. Don't be. I bet she'll be just fine. Once I come home in two months, I bet she'll be the same little girl I saw pictures of. And I hope she doesn't have that dograk, dograk virus. I that's been going a, a, around my camp, and I just named it the dograk virus because of people that were born as cats turned into dogs as they got older, and they never turned into cats again. Well, make sure Polar is okay. Why did you name her Polar in the first place? Because I thought it was a cute name. And we, and we basically live in Canada. Well, I guess you're right. Maine is pretty close to Canada. And it's pretty Arctic in Maine. Anyway. I hope she's safe. I gotta go. I gotta go into war. Bye, honey. See you later. Mwah. Two months later. Come in. Oh my gosh, honey, you're home. Come here. Oh, I'm so happy I'm here with you. I am so happy you're here. Oh my gosh. Mwah. I missed you so much. I missed you. Do you want to see her? I think she's sleeping. No, a little bag upstairs. But, yeah. The Paul hasn't changed at all, but the whole rest of her doesn't change it either. I guess that virus that they were talking about stopped. I hope. I hope she doesn't have that dog. Dogat? Dogat virus? It's, it's kind of a severe one. A lot of cats that were born four or three years ago can have it. So I was kind of worried about her. Oh. Well, I just hope she wasn't one of that. One of those ones that were born a couple years ago. Anyway, I'm gonna go see her. I'll, I'll go wake her up. <laughs> no. I'll wake her up. She'll think you're, you're a complete stranger. Oh yeah, it's a good idea. You should wake her up. <laughs> That's what I thought. Anyway, I'm gonna go wake her up. Why does she keep this thing in here anyway? Wake up! Why? Because I said so. You're gonna be late for school if you don't. I mean, you're gonna be late for breakfast if you don't. You can make us breakfast this morning. Yay! Okay, I'm getting out of bed. One second. I'll be down in two minutes. Okay. She'll be down in two minutes. Oh, okay. That was fast. Yeah, she loves making breakfast. Really? I hate making breakfast. I know you do. Whee! Okay. Who is this complete stranger? Um, this is your father. My father? You told me that he was coming back in another year. Well, I underestimated. I'm sorry. I mean, I overestimated. I'm sorry. Oh my god, daddy! Daddy, daddy! Oh god. <laughs> She's excited. Let her. Daddy, 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 Okay, get in your chairs, and I'll pull up a chair for you, mommy. Oh, thank you, sweetie. 
get in the chair now. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, time to be so. Do, 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 do. Yay, served. Okay. Uh, ow. Ooh. Ooh, that's gonna be a bad scar. Okay. Um, let's see. What do I have here for. Well, I can make some apple cider. Oh, hey, my friend. Okay. Uh, I can make some flower petals. Yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Add some sugar on that. <laughs> you like your cinnamon apples. Um, yes. I put cinnamon inside of the apple and it tastes like the cinnamon apples. And my mom said you like flower banquet cake. So I made you a flower banquet cake cereal. Mmm. This is pretty good for you. For me? What do you mean for me? Oh, I mean <laughs> for your age. So, I'm like the only- Oh, okay. I keep on falling! <laughs> okay. So, I'm like the only one that's my age that knows how to cook, like, cereals. Yes, you could be a cereal seller. Woo! Yay! Okay, mom, 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 mom. Whenever I'm older, I want to be a cereal seller. Whatever your destiny tells you. Sad eight, no, eight and a half years later. I don't know. Ever since my husband died four years ago, I don't know what to do. And ever since my baby girl got a dog at my wrist and turned into a dog, which was the day he died. I will never forget that day. Today was supposed to be our anniversary. He got shot and wound up in the hospital and had a heart attack at the same time. He got there and physically just stopped at the moment. I wasn't able to make it because there, it was too fast and he died quickly, and he is watching over us now. I'm still crying over these four years. I... I gotta... Maybe... I could... Send my da daughter po Polar to high school. I'm just kidding. Middle school. <laughs> Great idea. Yeah! And that's where it left off. <laughs> Tomorrow's my first day at middle school. I'm so excited. But I hope you guys enjoyed my backstory. See you guys later. Bye!